I think I think that you as a patient have a responsibility to your surgeon and to yourself to heed the warnings that they give you before surgery. So I was I quite like processes. I quite like, you know, things to do things properly because it's for good reason. Mm. So I vape, but I don't vape with nicotine. Um, and so I knew that would be okay. So I stopped that in its entirety. I started taking vitamin C. I back, I trained to sleep on my back so I would, wouldn't struggle afterwards. Nice. I did some mental training. So That's that good. I, so that I could train my mind to be stronger than my emotions for the ups and downs that I might experience. Um, so I took it all very, very seriously. And it's like with the taping and everything like that. The first time I did it was a bit of a mess, but I learned very quickly. And I just leave it alone. So to yep. minimise minimize really interfering with the scar tissue and letting it do its thing. And it's given me no bother at all. Yeah, brilliant. Amazing. Brilliant. I, I love that about training yourself to um, sleep on your back beforehand because most people are side sleepers. And yeah. then you have surgery and we ask you to sleep on your back. It's the first time you've tried to and you realise you can't. And you've got all this other stuff going on. You've got dressings. You might have drains. Not in your case, but you, one might have drains. You might have, uh, well, discomfort and pain. Now we're asking you to sleep differently too. So actually just removing that, that's something you can control beforehand. And you can just yeah. remove that from the mix. It's a really good idea. And a good night's sleep is so important to the healing process. Yeah. We, we've I, found that, I found that waking up after a few hours sleep, it would be weird because when you sit up, this is something I didn't expect, but when you sit up, it's like opening a bottle of a can of Pepsi. It just goes inside and it's just like, it's almost like you've woken them up and it takes a few seconds for them to settle down again. And you think, oh, what's going on? But you know, it's nothing. It's just them, I suppose, connecting, tissue reconnecting, I don't know. But that will settle down very, very quickly as well.